On the hill tonight for the Giants will be the right-hander, Logan Webb. He's the ace of the staff, 12 games, 4-4, four and four, 2.74 ERA. Webb at home has been invincible. I mean, he's got a 1-0-5 ERA in five starts. He's only given up five runs in 35 innings. Slowly hit, Chapman to his left, and he just gets Lopey who runs well. And that's how this game gets started. Logan Webb's got really good numbers when facing Juan Soto. Juan Soto just one for 13. And that's a base hit. And Soto puts the brakes on and he'll go back to first, holding with a single. These boos might be louder than last night. I think they are. And they are for center fielder Aaron Judge. He steps to the plate. Soto was about a foot off the bat. <laughs> Not hard to get back on that one. Where it goes. Foul and back out of play. Soto took off with that pitch and he'll go back to first. Check swing by Judge and the ball inadvertently glances off the bat and bounces foul. Three and two and Soto will once again turn around and go back to first. Runner goes. The pitch. Foul back to the screen. And Soto, who has run on each of the last three pitches, turns around and go back to first. Again. Still three and two to Aaron Judge. This next pitch will be the ninth from Webb. Driven deep to left field. Ramos back. Track. Wall. See ya. A long home run and a dream weekend for Aaron Judge. It's 2 nothing Yanks. This is really becoming ridiculous, Michael. I mean, this is some kind of pace that he has put together the last month or so. It's 21st of the year. Webb's only given up two home runs all year. Well, make it three and a long one. Uh, what a run. I, you don't know even what to say anymore. Well, we've seen this before with Webb. I mean, if he's going to give up some runs, it's usually going to be in the first inning. And the side is retired, but the Yankees, they strike first against Logan Webb. Cody Poteet, he has one start in the big leagues this year. That was April 13th at Cleveland. He pitched very well, got the win. One out, here is Wilmer Flores now. Swing at a liner, left field, moving in is Verdugo. He oh. dives in and he makes the catch. <laughs> Alex Verdugo with a last second dive, going to his knees, able to catch that ball off the bat of Wilmer Flores for out number two. The 0-2 pitch. Strike three, it was the changeup, and that is Poteet's calling card. He strikes Patrick Bailey out and retires the side in order in the bottom of the first. 0-2 on Austin Wells. Three pitches, see you later. Here's a swinging strike three by Austin Wells, and the inning is over, three up, three down. The Yankees lead the Giants 2-0. Three and two on Chapman. Chapman has an on-base streak of 18 straight games. Swing and a miss, strike three. Sweeper from Poteet, and there's one away. 1-1, one, one, rolled on the ground. Diving stop at first by Rizzo. Gets up, wheels around, throws to a covering Poteet, and it's in time at first. Rizzo, former gold glover at first base. So two down, and here is Elliot Ramos. The Giants have not had a base runner yet. Five in a row, retired. And down goes Ramos. And Poteet, six up, six down. Over two, we go to the third. Webb's pitch hit on the ground past the dive of the first baseman Flores into right field. Base hit for LeMayu to start off the third. There's Anthony Volpe. Line drive, it's a base hit to left field. It'll go to the warning track and to the wall. Double for Volpe, and the Yankees are set up. Second and third, nobody out. And now Juan Soto will hit with runners at second and third. High five ball, deep left, Ramos back. He's on the track, and he'll make the catch, tagging. LeMahieu, he'll score. Going to third is Volpe. It's a sack fly for Soto, and it's 3 0 Yanks. I mean, at some point, you got to start giving the opposing hitter the Barry Bonds treatment. You like that? Giants fans probably having flashbacks. This is what teams did to Barry Bonds for all those years, and right now, Judge feels like Bonds. I mean, it just feels like if you throw a pitch out over the plate, he's hitting it 400 feet. So Alex Verdugo, the hitter now. First and third. Ground ball and through for a base hit. Volpe scores. Judd stops at second. An RBI single for Verdugo. And the Yankees lead 4 0. And right now, Webb's pitching for his life. Schmidt has it. He'll step on second for one. Throws to first. Got him double play. So that time he threw a changeup. Stanton hit it right into the defense. And the Giants do turn two, but two more runs for the Yankees. So Brooks draws the walk. Giants have their first base runner of the game. Leading off the inning with Casey Schmidt coming up, and the Giants need to get some offense going. It's been a real quiet homestand. Schmidt hits one high. Hits it deep out of here. And it's his 
first of the year. A walk and a home run. First hit in the game for the Giants. And the Giants cut that Yankees lead down. It's four to two. And Poteet throws the sinker more than the four seamer, but again offering different looks. And he strikes Flores out with a changeup on the outside corner. And there's strike three. The third out, fourth strikeout for Poteet. Soto with a single and a run scored and a sack fly. Lined into center field. It is going to be past Manos. He tried the shoestring catch, and it goes all the way to the wall. Yastrzemski gets the ball. Here comes Soto going to third, and he will make it with a triple. A big blunder by Luis Matos, letting that ball get behind him. And the Yankees have a runner at third with two away for Aaron Judge. And the pitch. Swing and a miss. He got him. A fastball, a four-seam fastball that time, not the sinker. Right in the outside corner, strikes him out to end the inning. One, two. Ground ball. Backhanded by Volpe. Fires high over the head of Rizzo, and it bounces into the seats. And that allows Ramos to go to second. The Giants catch a break as it goes into the dugout of the Yankees. So now the force is gone, and you have a man in scoring position. Single E6. Swing and a miss. Got him on the curve. Brooks down on strike says Poteet came back from 3-0. Gets it on the hands of Schmidt. And Judge will make the catch. And tagging is Ramos. And he races the third and goes into the head first slide as the throw in from Judge is cut off by Volpe the shortstop. And wait a minute. They say that Ramos left second base too early. So none of the umpires are going to look at it. I mean, this is a big play. Well, yeah, down by two runs. Yeah. I mean, you're getting into the fifth inning here. Right now, it's, it's scored a double play, 8-6. No, they're going to overturn this. He was clearly on second base. And the Yankees are watching it on the big screen, and they're walking back out on the field. After review, the call was overturned. The runner is safe. He will be placed at third base. San Francisco will retain their challenge. So Wisely will indeed get a shot. So now here is Wisely, four to two Yankees, runner at third, swinging a hard ground ball in the right field, and it's four to three. That's a money hit, but again, it brings life into that dugout. It is such a big swing of the bat for the Giants. Yankees were up four nothing at one point. Now it's four three. Swinging a liner into right field, it's hanging up for Soto, and he makes the catch with two hands to put it away. And that's the third out. And it comes to a close, and the Giants get one unearned run. You mentioned it in the first inning. I mean, that's when he's most vulnerable. He gave up a two spot in the first, but everything starts to tighten up and get crisp, gets crisp as the as the evening wears on. That is strike three call. Torres called out on strikes for the second time tonight. Webb's been the one Giants pitcher consistently working deep into games. 0-2 pitch, got him swinging. Change up again for strike three. Now he's got six strikeouts. Here's a swing and a drive out towards right center. Angling back into his left, Matos is there to make the catch. That's out number three, and Logan Webb finishes seven tonight, and he's going to get a big ovation from Giants fans. He did a good job, especially considering some wobbly moments early in this game. So Melvin stays with the lefty against the lefty. And it's popped up. Left side of the infield, Volpe moving back now, called out in the left field area by Verdugo, and he makes the catch, puts it away. Wisely, and the Giants retired in the seventh inning is over. No runs on a hit. 30th appearance on the year for Walker, 4-2 of the 2170 ERA. Having a solid first half. It is slider, reach for and miss, strike three. The one out, and here is Juan Soto, the 0-2 pitch. High fastball, struck him out swinging. So I just can't believe he missed this. Climbs the ladder right across the letters. Grabs a pie and meat. Ground ball up the middle. Backhanded by Wisely. Throw to first over the head of Flores. Allowing Judge to reach. It'll be a single. So here's Verdugo. Runner at first. 4-3. Yankees on top. Top of the eight. High fly ball. Right center. And that is going to be over the try of Matos and up against the wall. Judge will score. Verdugo is going for three. He'll make it. It's an RBI triple. Yankees lead 5-3. It's a big run for the Yankee bullpen. 1-2 on Stanton. Swing and a deep blast down the left field line, looking at the corners. Ramos, and it is gone. A home run down the left field line. 
John Carlos Stanton, a two-run shot. And the Yanks are ahead now. It is seven to three bombers. And they are going to go to their closer, Clay Holmes, despite it not being a save situation. The two down, here comes Jorge Soler. There's a ground ball down the third base side, a fair ball, past the bag and down the line. It hits off the sidewall. Coming to third is Yaz, and he'll be stopped there by Matt Williams. A double for Jorge Soler. A hard grounder right past third and down the line. Yastrzemski is at third. Soler's at second. Casey Schmidt at the plate. High fly ball, left field. Verdugo makes the play, and the Yankees win again. The New York Yankees have taken the first two games of this series here in San Francisco.